system that is called the endocrine system. Does anybody know what the endocrine system is? Hmm? It's glands and hormones, it's a cascade. Okay, a lot of us need to understand the physiological part of your body that is not just coming here. Why I don't grow? What's going on with me? Why am I always feeling tired? Okay, is the nutrition? Oh, it's not the nutrition? Is your personal trainer? Oh, it's not your personal trainer? Then what is it? You better go to the doctor. If you feel that you nothing is happening to you and the diet is right and your coach is right and you're right, you got one more up than the doctor. Okay? Especially us guys after 40, we should have checkups every six months. Blood work will tell you exactly how your glands are producing hormones. And those hormones are secreted for the body to survive. Okay, what happens to a man when the testosterone levels are low? They get tired. They get tired. What happens with estrogen? When they fluctuate all the time? Huh? <laughs> so, what I want you to understand is like, what you eat is gonna reflect all the functions and everything that happens in your body. That's how you eat clean, like Craig, like I do, like all of you guys are doing, and that's why you guys have beautiful body. But I want you guys that go beyond, all right? When you live over here and start, when you're doing cardio, go to YouTube, travel to your body. And you know that a lot of us, we go to the mirror like, oh, look at me, look at me, look at me, ooh, God, beautiful. And then you put food in your cell, but you don't know what's gonna, what's happening inside you. Oh, I'm gonna stop and buy a Burger King. I'm gonna start. I'm gonna stop and Taco Bell. I'm gonna start. I'm gonna do this. I mean, you know, we we don't have many of us white castles. I used to be a white castle guy back when we were kids, but we didn't know exactly what was happening internal. Well, I said I said something before that is called maturity. And maturity comes with knowledge. So you put it together. So nutrition is the essence for every human being. So please teach that well. When people tell you I don't want to be like you, then yes you do. Okay, because inside, okay, you know, all they need all that organ of fat, what is there? Fibers, there's muscle, there's a beautiful shape. And honestly, we live in an era today that everybody wants to look good. How many people come to us straight with that, that they want to work for a company? Show them that somebody's asking me how, like, hey, I'm going to get a job, I'm going to get my phone to you. Yeah, so it's, it's a lot. You get even more than I do. Yes. So, you know, we live in an industry, now, you know, I have 20, 30, 100 girls that are beautiful. Who do you choose? So now you have to make selections. So we live in a, it's a very competitive uh, industry. But the greatest thing is about your health and how to live your life for the rest of your life. How many of you would like to get to 80, 100, you can in a healthy way? Okay? And that's the case today, all right? What in your mind and do? Nurturing your mind, nurturing your spirit, and nurturing your body. Okay? We bodybuilders eat six meals a day. Why do we eat six meals a day? To keep the fluid and nutrients for the system. What do we drink? What have you ever seen every bodybuilder with a with a gallon of water? What do we do with it? We look at it. <laughs> what happens when you drink it? And then after that? You urinate. You urinate. You urinate. You urinate. And what happens when you urinate? You get rid of toxins, but also vitamins, minerals, amino acid. You get rid of all the good stuff as well. And that's why we bodybuilders eat constantly throughout the day. We want to keep a good metabolic rate. We want to keep our bodies uh, healthy through ingesting food all the time. What is the secret of, of a diet, right? What is the secret that you guys do? Why do you guys look so great? I'm gonna tell you something. How many, how many of you guys have kids right now, like that two, three, four years old? Or something? Okay, I'm gonna ask you, how many bottles of milk do you give your kid a day? No, I'm talking about when they were little babies. Oh, when they were little. Every two hours, right? And then, and then the kids are growing, and you give them lunch. You never, you give them, I'm sorry, breakfast? Mid morning, lunch, mid afternoon, and dinner. We always do that with our kids because we think they're starving. And they actually, they are. Now we, we grow up, now I'm a big boy, I got a job. I don't have to take care of myself, I got to take care of my job. And I got to take care of my family. <coughs> Who's the most important person in your life? You. You. Then your family, then your job. 
So you put all this together, okay? Now you understand that you have to keep the body and do it. Now, with the, 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 the sport that we chose, bodybuilding, lifting, all that kind of stuff. So now we're doing six meals a day, we're drinking, a lot of people drink a lot of water. The, the amount of water for me is like each, uh, you have about eight ounces of water for each 25 pounds of body. <coughs> it's, it's pretty much what you want to do, all right? To keep flowing, you know, as you say, to for detoxification, with transportation, vitamins and minerals. All right, so now within the six meals, I know a lot of people say, how many calories should we have on, 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 for my kind of bodies? That's something that you gotta touch base with your nutrition. But this also number that you could uh, start learning about it. You know, a lot of people know that, that some people has to have 40% protein, 40% carbohydrates, 